Fly fishing leader and tippet are broke down into two material categories, nylon and fluorocarbon. I'm Josh Jenkins from Scientific Anglers, and I'm gonna go over the pros and cons of each and where they're most useful. Nylon, which is sometimes called nylon copolymer, is by far our most common option for angling situations. And within SA's Absolute Leader and Tippet program, it can be easily identified by the background color of the packaging. If you have a silver background color on your leader or your tippet packaging, you know it's nylon copolymer. The main advantage to nylon copolymer is that it has generally a higher wet knot strength per diameter in comparison to fluorocarbon. So in most fishing situations, it's gonna be a little bit stronger than fluorocarbon. It also has a lower density, which means that it's gonna have a tendency to keep your flies on the water surface if that's important to you. Fluorocarbon can be easily identified in absolute leader and tippet by a black background on the packaging. So if you have a black background on either your leader packaging or your tippet packaging, you know that it's fluorocarbon. And there's a few distinct advantages of fluorocarbon over nylon. Probably the biggest one is the abrasion resistance. So if you're in a fishing situation where there's a possibility of that leader or tippet to go over something abrasive and you wanna make sure it survives, fluorocarbon is gonna be a great option. It also has a higher density, which means that it sinks a little bit faster than nylon. So if I'm fishing a sunk fly presentation, something like a nymph or a streamer, and I wanna to try to get that fly down a little bit quicker, fluorocarbon is also gonna be very useful there. And finally, the refractive index or the clarity of fluorocarbon is much closer to water. So it's gonna be less visible under the water than nylon would be in the same diameter. Within each family of nylon and fluorocarbon, we can also make small changes to the hardness to tailor it to specific situations. For example, our trout nylon is gonna be pretty supple and it's gonna be designed to deliver a small dry fly better with a drag-free drift. And as we move up to our saltwater nylon and we get into things like our hard mono, it's gonna be a lot more stiff. That's gonna deliver a larger fly in saltwater situations. The same thing applies to fluorocarbon. Our trout fluorocarbon is gonna be more supple and better for trout flies. And as you move up to saltwater applications, it's gonna get harder and more abrasion resistant. So whether you're fishing trout with nylon or you're fishing heavy mono or fluorocarbon in the saltwater, the absolute range of leader and tippet has you covered.